What's up, YouTube? PSU Mike here. T minus 24 hours, or give or take, until Phoenix. Uh, Zach will be up here. We'll probably head up there after he gets here, stretches his legs from his drive up from Philly to here, and then rip, ripping time. But today we have mail. Um, I got this the other day, yesterday. Uh, Lamar Stevens. Got to get, you know, I'm not a big basketball collector, but I do get the, the Penn State guys that go to the league, like Josh Reeves last year and Tony Carr the year before. I have to see. I don't know if Watkins will be have cards made yet or not for this year. But anyway, so there's that one packager. And then next up, we'll save Snods for last. That's a, that's a hefty... That's going to have baseball and foosball and whole gambit of stuff. This is from Cody. He had himself a little fire sale. I picked a couple things up. He had a, I guess for skunking in a break or something, somebody gave him a pack of cards. And when you see what it is, you'll understand why he gave it to me. I gotta get on these people's level with this blue tape. I set my stuff out with masking tape on. I mean, it's the same concept, it's just not blue. Way more than what I bought in your fire cell, Cody. I guess you gave me a whole lot that had the KJ in it. Okay. Save the cardboard for if I ever need to ship something out here in the near future. That saves me time having to cut my own. And then bubble wrapped yet again inside here. This little bubble mailer, sized or whatever you want to call this. So, there's the pack he got. Up in that last. First up, Saquon Barkley. Die cut out of 25. Power formulas, you know, giant sticker. And the red Saquon Barkley. Got a out of 500 Saquon, Lawrence Taylor, Saquon, Saquon. And then this one. Hey, Cody, I'm an Eagles fan, but bro. <laughs> I don't know if that LT was in with the uh, other stuff or not. I appreciate it. I'm, a, I'm, I'm just, I'm an Eagles fan. More or less collect Saquon because he went to Penn State. There's KJ. Locke, Locke, Miller, Atwater, Melvin Gordon. So, there's that. So, Penn State Proud right there. There we go. Had them all shoved down in there. Okay, let's open this up. Let's pack. I do believe that you can get like autographs and patches and stuff in this stuff. I just don't know how common it is to have happen. I have this whole set already though. So I do know they have patches and they have autos. And... What am I hitting another Saquon for my set? Gary okay, Gilliam, Dion Barnes, Stephen Wisniewski, Paul Pozlesny. I don't have that insert though. Beaver Stadium, Nanny Lion, Pagula. And Penn State Panini. So, excellent. I don't have the honors of that one. So, that's a nifty, nifty one to get. My Penn State binder. Which gives you guys a little insight of, of what my Penn State binder is. It is this. All Penn State players. No doubles. None of my number stuff either. My number stuff I sleeve and top load. Okay, so next is none other than Snodzilla Breaks. Should be a couple breaks in here. Personal of Spectra that I bought. So, 
just roll with it. This looks like my Spectra. And whatever. Baseball. That's why I had the. I got a random team in the. You know, met whatever he did for baseball. He lined some teams. I got a team in that. If I can get the cards out, that'd be fantastic. What on earth? There we go. There we go. Oh, we got a, huh, Zach Gallen, Zach Gallen, Marte, Marte, Gallen. I like the dole, that goalie. What's nice? And then we got a, out of Spectre, we got, say, the Twins, 22 out of 25. I didn't realize he got an auto, too. Look at that. Jake Cave, not numbered. I did. It's actually pretty good. I didn't even watch it. 59 out of 99. America's pastime. Domingo Labia. Leba. <laughs> Persephone got the... Uh, my wife got a team too. So I got the in Twins. She got the Diamondbacks. Huh, how about that? And then in, at the break I had Philly... Or the mixer, the two boxes, a box of NT and a box of Spectra. I had the Eagles and I had the Broncos. Six out of ten, Jalen Rhaegar. On card auto. There's more baseball. And then I had the Broncos, like I said. So here's some Spectra. Cortland Sutton at a 99. Okay, the rest of the box is Spectra. My personal. One hell of a fire cell coming to a Facebook page near you. We have Monumental. Uh, 60. 50 is, oh, that's bookend 60 is 60. We have Hester out of 99. CJ Henderson out of 199. Trevon Diggs for the Cowboys. That's out of 75. Clyde Edwards Alaire. Looks like it's some stitching there on that through there. Out of 99. Jack Ham, Penn Stater, out of 10. 7 of 10. And this is Championship Gear, TD. Player-worn used material. Awesome. Out of 75. So. Next up. I forget what else I got. I was... What else was there? This would be in here. Where's that connect? What else is it? Oh, the rest of my spectrum. What the hell? Okay. Of course, more bills. If you guys saw my box of XR, all I pulled was bills on that son of a gun. So we got Monumental out of 15. Got Rise Above, Michael Pittman Jr. out of 30. Got a uh, Anthony McFarland Jr. I think this is out of four. Yep, two of four. Anthony McFarland Jr. Brian Edwards out of seventy-five. Mike Allstott out of thirty-five. This is a longer video than I thought it would be. So, D 
DJ Dallas out of 20, 20 of 20. Darren Waller out of 99. Darrington Evans out of 99. Trubisky out of 35. Darrington Evans out of 25. And Nick Bosa out of 50. So I'll have to get some top loaders for those couple there. Top load them up. But anyway, stay tuned. Uh, next or the end of tomorrow, after Zach comes up, I'll be ripping some some boxes of Phoenix with him. Be all it'll be a fun time for everybody. And then Saturday, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to how to feel. Um, oddly enough, eerily enough, I have the same feeling this Friday. That I had Friday before the whiteout in 2016. And I haven't spent the day before and, and the morning of with Zach since 2016. So uh, uh, re read into that what you will. I'm not laying money on that game. But I feel eerily optimistic in the outcome. That maybe we won't be beat by 50. Uh, maybe against Indiana, Franklin thought he didn't want to show his whole hand. Who knows? But we are out. We are out our top two running backs. So let's test the depth in that room a while. Plus, Luketa is going to be out for the first half of the game. So let's test the room there. Luckily, those two positions are ones that we are absolutely beyond deep at. I mean, we have Kaz Holmes. You know, backing up the other two. And if you guys want to go see some highlights of him, he's Saquon 2.0. Well, not 2.0. He's not better than Saquon, but he's cut from the same cloth, it seems. Uh, Ford, if he learns how to run smarter, you know, don't run the ball in the end zone when they're clearly letting you. It's for a reason. Um, and then on the defensive side, we have, you know, Brandon Smith, who is, you know, going to be just fine. Um, Dixon, it'll be fine. Like we'll we'll, we'll be okay. Luketa is gonna hurt, and I have it for the first half. But I think we'll, we'll plug and play. We're at a point where we're not, you know, you lose a starter, and you're scared anymore. We have some depth beyond depth at some key positions. Not every position. We're not gonna plug and play every position, but key positions. You know, linebacker, running back. Um, I think we're we're pretty straight there, and even uh, well. We don't use tight ends enough to, to know what we have behind Pat. But Pat's the number one tight end of the nation. And you guys need to go look up his stats, look up his tape. Look, Pitt, that Pitt's kid from Florida, he's pretty good, sure. I'm not going to say he's not good, but he ain't no Pat Fryermuth. Go check his highlights. You'll, you'll see why, you know, the Big Ten isn't necessarily going bananas about the, that Pitt's kid. We have tight ends in our conference, too. Don't you, don't you worry your, your little pretty little heads. We'll be fine. And... When you see Pat Fryermuth go before Pitts this uh, draft, you're like, oh, well, how'd that happen? Well, because Pat's better than Pitts. Leave it at that. Anyway, hope you all have a wonderful rest of your week. Tomorrow's Friday, release day. I'll see you then.